Hey Sarah, good to hear from you. I'm only going to help you if you can send me some of that Raising Cane's chicken. <laughs> uh, anyhow, hey, if you click on any tapestry, if you click on Management, and then on this, you go to User Defined Fields. And then after User Defined Fields comes up here, we're going to click on, there's a section to like Import Sets. Did that click? And then um, there's going to be a list of, uh, on the side here, there's a define field, add define field sets here. Kind of tricky. So click on that. And then there's a, a big list of items that are, they've got, eTapestry's got some built-in user define fields that you can enable within the system. Um, that aren't already enabled. So you can click on event fields here. Look for that. And then here you're going to have, if you click on the support event set, then you're going to get all these fields and values here. Um, all, you know, these text fields. And then it's telling you to create these other things. So approaches to create and queries to create. And then further down is reports to create. Um, so that's going to be, you're going to want to create each of these things. So all this other stuff, when you hit the import event set and ask you that, then it'll create a lot of the stuff at the top that then you've got to manage. And then it wants you to create the approaches and the queries and the reports um, to help you manage that event. All right, take care.